I'm Jubal Wright. Um, I've been in a chair for 12 years now. Broke my neck mountain biking. Yeah. Where are you from? Uh, originally Williams Lake. Um, so how did you get involved with Spinal Cord Injury BC? Uh, probably be Brad Jacobson. He's probably involved with everybody though. Big yeah through through GF Strong. Yeah. Yeah. That's the best. Yeah. Um, and why why do you keep coming out to or do you keep coming out to Spinal Cord Injury BC events? Is this like a uh, random thing? Yeah. This I I usually go camping myself, and I James was set and. James had told us about this and I went, sure, I haven't, I haven't been out camping yet this year, so <laughs> come out and check out the boats and stuff. Um, what kind of, like, what kind of events have you participated in with us? Um, well, I've been out hands, like, I go out hand cycling with James quite a bit. Um, I think Spinal Cord BC was, has been involved in some wheelchair rugby events. I played on the BC team for a couple of years, so. Yeah. Um, what do you think is the best part about the peer support program? I think I think it being able to being able especially with new injuries being able to get out and live life, not not have not being worried about say like this being out camping and realize you kind of need to push boundaries a little bit and get comfortable with that and yeah. That's awesome. Um, so, since you've been involved with Spinal Cord Injury BC, like, how has how has this organization had an impact on your on your life? Um, I guess just meeting new people and yeah, being exposed to different things that we can do and yeah. Do you think that um, when you hang out with other people in chairs, there are, there are things that you can talk about that you can't talk about with your family or friends? Yeah. Can you give me some examples? Um, well, anything or bowel or bladders it, with guys in chairs, it's just like <laughs> pretty normal. <laughs> Anybody else, it's kind of why are we talking about this? <laughs> what when you left GF Strong? Well, first of all, how old were you? You look really young. I was 21 when I broke my neck. Yeah. So, what was the hardest thing that you had to deal with when you left GF Strong? Um. I, I don't know. Um, I'm st I'm stubborn as hell, so I just I went screw it. I, I put my I put myself back through school right away. So yeah, I just kind of just got on with life. So yeah. <laughs> um, what would you tell someone with a new injury who's just leaving GF Strong right now? Um, don't don't let the chair hold you back. It, just keep living your life. Do what you want to do. If you like doing something before your accident, figure out how to do it after. And yeah. And um, would, how would you tell someone about Spinal Cord Injury BC? What would you tell them about this organization? Um, definitely a good organization to come out to, to events like this and meet new people and experience new things. Yeah. yeah.